I'm going to throw this in here in the beginning. Last month, no, August, it's October, you guys. I told you guys I went to Burlington. You remember I showed you a live haul? I believe it was live. Yeah. And I told you guys I was looking for jackets for the kids. Son needed a jacket. The girls had actually two and um, two more. And I still couldn't find him one. So there were only three. And I put these on Lailway because I just didn't want to come home and have him broken hearted again over no jacket. But I went back and got them before... You know, the time was up. I had never actually done that. But I went back and got them. Because I found him a jacket later that day. But these are the jackets. This one, there was one olive. So this is an olive. And this one is, they're limited to. Really cute. Light. And I figure if it's raining, you know, they can wear it as, as well. And then there were black. So there was two black ones and an olive. So I think... Zion and Layla got the black ones and Aaliyah took the olive one but basic basic $20 and I think I shared my son's jacket in the other haul but really cute really cute really stylish so I'm gonna go ahead with the rest of the rest of the Good goods morning. All right. or afternoon or evening hey I am back to share a fall winter haul we don't get terribly cold weather here but we do get cold weather we have to wear long sleeves and occasionally a uh, jacket usually never a coat more more than a day but um, I needed some more fall pieces and so what I have here let me start with this all right we have a couple things some of the stuff I need to still grab and bring over here but we have just a basic black Gap shirt. We have another gap shirt. I just somehow I'm a black white person. Denim, dark denim, that's my thing. But I wanted to bring in some more color, even though it is fall. I just thought these pieces would go and they are long sleeves. So yeah, kind of out of my realm, but they were cute. This is like a cream. It looks white, but it's a cream. So I thought that would be cute just to give me some more color and yeah gap again love this little boat neck finish hanging this stuff up but i'm just this color i'm feeling this color if you guys remember back to the burlington hall i shared sweater and it was actually darker but this color um i have qu quite a few i'm gonna say quite a few but things that color i just like the color then i just have a basic white gap shirt all right to the bottoms all right so like i said i'm black white dark denim but i wanted to add some color for the fall i'm on the hunt for black jeans i, I need some black jeans mine are faded and i don't like to wear faded black jeans so i didn't find them but i did find these and so this is like a what is this color i know this color it's like a salmon color i forgot the actual name but um and I actually wanted distressed I couldn't find distressed I may I don't know I may just distress all of these myself but I wanted distressed jeans I couldn't these are the Amanda jeans let's see there we go there we go I have another pair there's this color again and I did not really get these to go with that top not specifically I'm not that matchy matchy but I would probably use something like this or the black just to whatever but yeah classic all right and then I have this color this is like the um I want to say antique rose I think is what this one is um it didn't really say on here Calvin Klein yeah it didn't tell but yeah Calvin Klein and then I have a brown pair and I have another pair and these are actually they kind of look the same but they're not and then you can also see the material is different they're not exactly these are more like a denim this is more like a sateen they're smooth more like a pant and then I have this brown and I'm not really a fan of brown but I do have some things I have some shoes and things 
that go with this. That's the reason why I chose it. And I think pretty much everybody does brown in the fall. So, there's that. I'm going to move this stuff off the bed and bring the rest of the stuff. Right, like I said, everybody did get something this day from Costco. We picked up a lot of stuff. I think more clothes than food. And um, they had just put this stuff out. And what else I was going to say? There's something. I, when I get to it, I'll tell you because it's not here. They, t It belonged to somebody and they took it already. But um, what they had... For the boys, they had these uh, jogger sets, two-pack of jogger sets. And these were $12.99 for the two of them. There was another set, I think, with black and camo, like a green camo, but I didn't pick that pack up. But I think he has a couple black pair. But, um, yeah, so I picked these up. All the little pockets in the drawstring. So these are real easy. And they are heavy. So, right, for the girls, they had two pack BCBG girls dress set. Now, there are, there's one more set, I think, that I did not get. It, might, it may have been two more. I'm trying, I can picture one of the sets in my head. I know what it looks like because I just saw it the other day. But um, I didn't get them both sets. I got them one set each. So, for the little ones, they got the, uh, it's like a pink blush color. The little glitter. And this gray with the copper um, star. <coughs> There's that little skater dress. Alright, and for Layla, I picked up this one, BCBG Girls, Kind Hearted. So this is like an oatmeal. And then the star print, or heart print, the black. The other one I know, I think it was black. And um, I know the other one was burgundy. And it had, I think it was a silver... Either hearts or stars or something. I didn't get that set. But I think you guys will see that in the shopping haul. You'll see it, actually. So, that's the one. I may go back and get those. I just have not decided. But these were the ones I wanted first. So they can have some more dresses. And, of course, we have tons and tons of leggings. So that will take care of that. And for myself, they had these tops. And I had just been looking at them. I went ahead and picked some up. This had this little detail back here in the back. There we go. So this is like a grape, light grape color. And then I picked up this green. I think they probably had a black, a white, and probably a gray. But, um, yeah. thought these would be nice and easy. I can throw on with, with a pair of jeans, ca just casual. Throw on a jacket, a, a denim jacket, and keep it moving. Something I don't have to fuss with. Because sometimes that's just my thing. I can't find the top. So, I picked those up. This one, I just like the style of it. Different stripes. I just typically don't do stripes. Kind of an oatmeal color. And this one I was kind of unsure of, and I'm glad I picked up this one. They looked really short. It looked like lengthwise they ran short. So I was toggling between, I picked up a medium, and then I picked up the large. And I just didn't think lengthwise. And they do run really short. So this, even though it's an extra large, it covers. It, uh, you know, hits at the top of my waist. So, uh, maybe a, an inch, you know. It's perfect, but I'm glad I did get, go ahead and get the bigger size, even though I thought otherwise. So, basic little Henley type top there. Yeah, I don't think it's quite that long, <laughs> even though that's where it's pictured on her, and I'm not that tall. So, yeah. All right. Same thing with the jacket. I like my jackets to fit loose, not really tight. So, I picked up this set. 
this Puma set. Actually, it wasn't a set. They were separate. Um, oh, I didn't tell you guys the price. I'll go back. These were $14.99 a piece. And one of my girls also got, she got the jacket. They had the bridal rose. And that's like um, this color. You guys know Puma, that Rihanna color, that signature pinkish. She picked up the jacket. I would have gotten that one, but I wanted the pant as well. So I went with the gray. And they also had black. So that is what I got. There's that. And it's so cute. And the thing is, I like this. There are other Bridal Rose Puma pants but they don't have this detail and this is what set that jacket off um like i said hers is that color it's the same jacket i wish it was a hoodie that was the thing i almost hesitated i wish it was a hoodie i just it's just something about it um i wanted a hoodie and i think i picked up puma no i picked up fila last year i probably never shared but um something very simple casual quick to throw on if I'm going to the store or something like that um, get the kids yeah but I am going to look like I said I wanted the pink they still have the jackets I'm waiting to see I might just go ahead and grab the jacket and wait for them to bring the pants because I know they're going to bring the pants but I don't know why they didn't put them out and the pants I have searched and searched and searched I haven't found them yet online um, they were sold out so I'm kind of bummed about that because I really like that color. Even though I'm not a pink person. I just really, you know, it was just something about that color because it was very subtle. It's not really a pink pink. It's kind of, it's subtle. So I can do that. And um, we are eventually headed to the mall because they have a some shoes. We saw these shoes that we want. So that's that. But I thought I would come on and share this. Like I said, $14.99 a piece. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. It's ragweed season. I'm going to say this was $12.99. These were $9.99. Like I said, the dress sets were $12.99. So, you know, you can't beat that $6. Um, $6.50 a dress. You can't beat that. And the same thing with the with the uh, joggers. You can't beat that at all. These are just so well done. Very thick inside. And I just don't see him wearing out these anytime soon. So that is our little uh, re-up for the fall, winter. And... Um, yeah, I think I'm pretty much set. I do have some long sleeve Henley type sh uh, tops from um, last year. So I'm good in the way of things. Like I said, shoes are the only thing that I am going to purchase from this point. And um, PJs. I was looking for PJs and they didn't have PJs out their size. That was the main thing I was looking for that day. And I ended up just getting the, um, the clothes, but I do need to get PJs. This just seems like something hard. I so miss Jimboree in the Jimmies, but, um, they are telling me they need PJs. I know they need PJs. So that's something I'm lo on the lookout for. PJs are so pricey for pjs so you guys let me know where you find good quality pjs that don't stretch and fade and you know things so quickly that's what i'm looking for but i know they did have um tens they went up to size 10 at um kirkland costco but um i bought them tens last year so i'm looking for 12 14 14 16 that size so hopefully when i go back um today they'll have something out because that just seems to be like the hardest thing right now is finding these kids and pjs but um yeah i said we are all set i have bottoms 
find my black jeans and I will be good good to go y'all the struggle is real like I said sometimes I just don't want to go out I don't feel like getting dressed because I can't find any clothes you know I just I think I prefer fall over any season I think so because it seems like I have more options it's like my summer stuff wears out faster than my fall stuff and um, like I said this is just simple casual throw on and go and I have the other bottoms if I want to color you know if I have a meeting or something like that that's mainly what this stuff is for because I don't always wear black but I do have a habit I'm a black white type of thing especially for a meeting or something um, you know working yeah but if I'm just at home working I can just deal with this and I'm good anyway guys if you have any uh, hauls shopping hauls let me know please then let me know to uh, link me your video